What's up, YouTube? This is Chris Man G713, and today um, I'm gonna bring you a video on the effects of the EMP grenade. I know a lot of y'all do not know what it fully does, uh, what it's capable of, too. Um, it can be good and it can be bad. Right here is a, it's not a good thing, right here. If you see a power drop and you try to throw an EMP around it, like let's say you want to like slow them down, like I'll show you what it does in a little bit. See how it just goes away. Oh, it's really bad if you really need it. So if you have a max ammo and you want to throw them, do not throw them next to the um, next to the power drop because it will um, go away. And this is a good way of getting past zombies and using the boss. If you use an EMP grenade and throw it next to zombies, they will like just like sleepwalk. And if you just go crouch or you just walk around and don't touch them, shoot or run, then um, they will just stay like that until you do run or anything like that it's pretty good if you're um, getting trapped and stuff like that see I, right here I just jump and um, as soon as I start running tell you all wake up and then just start come attacking me um, it's a really good thing if you need to use the box or you want to go get some perks and stuff let's see if you get down and throw it down and yeah and right here is another bad thing which would probably be good for oh no this is the bus one um, this is very bad. Let's see if you accidentally press the L2 button or LT for Xbox. See how the robot goes down? The driver Ted. And um, the bus does start slowing down after the, each stop. And if you throw an EMP gear like that, look what it does. It just stops. It's really annoying because um, a lot of times I will accidentally just press um, I will press that L2 by accident. And right here. If you throw a grenade, um, an EMP grenade next to a perk, you will see that it, it turns off. And if you look to the bottom left of the screen, the speed color is faded out. That means it is turned off. Cause you'll see right here, I'm not reloading fast, just a regular reload. You do have to wait for it to turn back on. Um, which is really why the EMP grenade is not really the best choice unless you're really um, using it for grief. Because grief is really good, you control the other teammates. And I do have a way of trolling on um, um, Grief, um, it's really great. Um, you can actually win g games like that too. Um, I will post that up tomorrow or Friday. In a little bit, you'll, you, you will hear the um, the bus honking, and that means that uh, there's time that it's gonna start going again. Um, but this, whenever it's EMP is different, once it haunts once, then it's going to start going. It doesn't haunt twice like it usually does. Uh, it just haunts once and then you have to get to it really, really quick. Um, so right here, it honked once and it started leaving already. Luckily, if I, if I didn't have stamina, most likely I wouldn't have got on it. Uh, yeah. Um, hopefully I'll um, find out how the EMP grenade works and stuff like that. Oh, and right here. I do show a secret pass to the town in case y'all don't know. You can press log in and I see that truck that I just passed. You can go back in the video to see it. And you make a left on it. And you will find a little path that goes straight to the town. It's really useful if you need to get to the town. Let's see if you buy Juggernaut if you get down. Um, just from the second bus stop to the uh, last bus stop. It's really great. Um, a lot of people do not know about it. It's really useful. I um, use it all the time. Because yeah, time is mostly my best spot to go to or the farms and um yeah that's a really great thing to do um remember to like and subscribe um hopefully this helped y'all out a lot hopefully y'all will see how the EMP grenade works and how it will be useful to you so um please give it a like if it helped you understand and peace out y'all